The Houthis just attacked the United States and the U.S. struck back, with them yesterday hitting a U.S.-owned cargo ship with an anti-ship missile. And that after on Sunday they fired an anti-ship cruise missile at the USS Laboon, which is an American destroyer. And that missile had to be intercepted by a U.S. fighter jet, with America striking the Houthis three times this past weekend. And today, the U.S. conducted another strike on the Houthis, hitting their anti-ship batteries as they were preparing to strike even more ships. The captain of the aircraft carrier that's been striking the Houthis tweeted out, nobody messes with Taco Tuesday after today's operations. And the White House said today, we're not looking to expand this. The Houthis have a choice to make, and they still have time to make the right choice. And not long after today's strike, the Houthis hit yet another cargo ship. Also, U.S. Navy SEALs conducted a nighttime raid on a weapons shipment to the Houthis, with them seizing Iranian-made ballistic missile and cruise missile components. And the Navy SEALs sank the ship, arrested the crew, and now two Navy SEALs are missing at sea after a mishap while boarding. Meanwhile, Iran has deployed commanders and advisors from its Revolutionary Guard to Yemen. U.S. and Middle Eastern officials allege that Iran is providing intelligence and operating missiles and drones on behalf of the Houthis. And this is rapidly developing, so follow to stay in the loop.